Hi MPPNs, good morning. You have learned science chapter 1. Now we will have chapter number 2. What is the name of the chapter? Our basic needs for health. What is the name? Our basic needs for health. Okay. So shall we start this chapter? Good. What is the first topic we will learn? See, the first topic is our basic needs. Read it. Our basic needs. We have to live and grow. We have to live and grow. Many things help us keeping alive. There are many things which help us to be alive. We have to live and we have to grow. And to grow and to live, there are many things which help us. And what are they? Fresh air, clean water, nutritious food, seasonal clothes and airy house are our basic needs. What are our basic needs? Fresh air, clean water, nutritious food, seasonal clothes and airy house. These five things are our basic needs. We need all these things to live and grow. Now we will learn about all these five things. First one is fresh air okay you are ready right so we will learn about fresh air we need fresh air to breathe we need fresh air to breathe we breathe in we take in oxygen and for that we need fresh air it should be free from dust and smoke. The air which we breathe in should be dust free. It should be free from dust and smoke. It should not have dust and smoke. Now see this picture. Air is fresh and this fresh air is very necessary for us we must breathe in only fresh air if you breathe in the dirty air the polluted air what will happen you will fall sick you will be sick you will fall ill so what should you do you should breathe in fresh air okay so fresh air is very important now we will see second one what is that clean water clean water clean water how do we use it or why do we use clean water see we need clean water to drink we need clean water to drink we must drink clean water it should be free from germs the water which we drink should be free from the germs it should not have any germs if the water is not clean filter and boil it the water which you drink, if the water which is not clean, then what should you do? You should filter and boil it. You should not drink the water that is not clean. 
Now see this picture, how clean is the water. This much clean should be the water which you drink. You should always drink clean water. Okay, so two things I told you. Number one, you should breathe in fresh air. Number two, we should drink fresh water. If your water is not fresh, you can make it fresh. How? You can filter it or you can boil it. So, we are moving to the third one. I told you that there are five things which are our basic needs. I, we completed two of them now. So, shall we go to the third one? Okay, the third one is here. What is the third one? It is nutritious food. Our third basic need is nutritious food. We need nutritious food to eat. We should eat nutritious food. Food helps us to become strong. You can become strong if you eat food and what type of food should you eat? You should eat nutritious food. Nutritious food means the food which gives you energy. Nutritious food is that food which gives you energy. Why do you need energy? You need energy to do the work. You need to play. You need, need to go to school. You need to go to other places. For that you need energy. And to get energy, what you should do? You should eat food. And what type of food should you eat? You should eat nutritious food. Okay. Air, water and food helps us to grow. If you want to grow, then what should you do? You should have fresh air, clean water and nutritious food. When we grow, we gain height. When we grow, we gain height. We add weight. When we grow, we gain height and we gain weight also. Okay, when you were in class nursery, you were very small. But now, you have gained height and weight, which means that you have grown. How did you grow? You grew by eating food. And what type of food did you eat? You ate nutritious food. You always should eat nutritious food. Okay. And our legs grow faster. Others grow slowly. When we gain height and weight, our legs grow faster. Then the other parts grow very slowly. Okay. Now you have come to know the importance of nutritious food. We have now learned the importance of fresh air, clean water and nutritious food. So, let us see what are the other two things. The fourth thing is seasonal clothes. We should wear seasonal clothes. We should wear seasonal clothes. We need seasonal clothes to wear. According to the season, you have to wear your clothes. Clothes cover and protect our body. Why should you wear clothes? You should wear clothes because they cover and protect our body. The clothes protect and cover our body. And what type of clothes should you wear? You should wear clean clothes. You should wear neat and clean clothes. 
okay it should be properly washed and ironed then only you will wear that cloth understood it and in different seasons we wear different clothes we wear different clothes in different seasons according to the season we wear clothes why do we wear clothes because clothes cover and protect our body and what type of clothes should you wear you should wear only clean clothes now i will show you some of the clothes you wear have a look these are the clothes you wear and your clothes should be neat and clean okay so you will wear only neat and clean clothes you will not wear if it is dirty okay now the last one what is the last one airy house what is the last one airy house what do you mean by airy house the house which has air circulation the house in which air passes that type of house is called airy house your house should be airy we need an airy house to live we cannot live in a den can you live no we cannot live in a cave or den why because they are not airy we need an airy house to live in a house protects us from the following things why do we need a airy house or why do we need a house because the house protects us from many things and what are those things heat cold rain and enemies the house protects us from heat cold rain and enemies okay and what type of house should you live in you should live you should live in airy houses okay so what did we learn today we learned about different basic needs see this house this house is airy because it has doors and windows okay so shall we wind up the class today mm -hmm. so okay we have completed the chapter stay safe stay home okay bye